Often, people who suffer the effects of PTSD are reluctant to seek out qualified medical care. What can I do to help a person with PTSD? As a support person in the life of someone that has post-traumatic stress disorder, there are some important things that you can do to support and help them in their healing process. One thing is being available when they are ready to talk so that you can be a good, authentic listener and be empathic to them and validate the horror that they went through and the feelings that they're struggling with as they're trying to recover. What is a normal reaction to trauma? A normal reaction to trauma are so many different things that could be normal. It could be nor normal to be stunned into silence after something horrible happens. It could be normal to cry and scream and, and, and get outraged. There's a whole range of normal human reactions, behaviors, feelings, expressions, interactions. But what's not normal is to lose your confidence in yourself, to become hopeless and helpless and worthless. It's not normal to have flashbacks. Uh, it's not normal to have symptoms that last more than a month. I, I was part of the group that wanted to define post-traumatic stress disorder as a normal reaction to abnormal events, but I'm now convinced that it isn't. Just as a broken bone is not normal.